guys so welcome to vlogmas day six how are you guys doing so today was actually my first day on a very strong antibiotic and i've been nauseous very nauseous all day long from it um i'm just not feeling the greatest because i also have the cold and it's just when you're doing vlogmas you're going to see the ups and the downs, the trials and the errors of a month <laughs> of my life. So I hope you guys are doing better than me. I'm actually about to meal prep, truly meal prep. Obviously I need to wash these. Um, I'm just gonna do brown rice. I'm gonna bake some chicken with seasonings. <clears throat> Y'all hate on me for some seasonings. Um, and green beans, um, just living my best life, just kidding. So probably going to do chicken, green beans, brown rice, simple. So let's do the chicken together as a unit, although I don't know why I do this to myself because People don't like my food at all. Aluminum foil, obviously. Um, one of these doodads. Set the oven to press the wrong button. I'm gonna set it to 440. No, 425. Get the chicken, play by play, I swear. And a knife. This is my preferred knife. A cutting board. For chicken. Why do I need a cutting board? Why do I need a knife? Oh my god. Ugh. I'm not cutting the chicken. I'm so used to cutting it in cubes. I don't need this, honey. Huh? I do need a fork and seasonings. Garlic powder. Garlic salt, pepper, and onion powder. You guys already know. So. Pam. Oh no. Now I'm just gonna lay out the chicken. They're cute little tenders. I don't like big, huge meats. I'm good, I'm good. Okay, garlic salt. Onion powder. I decided not to use the garlic powder. Pepper. Done. And then this just goes in the oven. So meal prep is complete. A serving of rice was actually a lot more and it didn't fit in just this one spot, so I had to put it there too. So each one of these has a serving of chicken, which is four ounces. 
which this is actually a little less than four, but that's fine. A serving and a half of green beans and a serving of brown rice. Yum. So I'm actually about to eat me one because I was meal prepping for three days. And the only reason why I put one in a container is because I wanted to make it even. And yeah, so I'm about to eat me some of this. This is my first meal of the day and I'm pumped. So I finished my food. Look what I did with the rice pieces. I don't even know. Anyways, it was really good. Now I have meal prep for the next three days. And yeah. Hey guys, so I just got my package today for my clear lip liner because you know, I got that problem. <laughs> so let me show you guys, let me see how it looks. I know these scissors are big and dramatic. They're just like my personality. <laughs> Girl, this is harder to call off than an X. Let's see. Oh, well, they didn't even send me anything. There's nothing even in here. I can't open this. Okay. So this is the kind that you guys recommended to me. It is Moisture Renew by Remiel or Remel London. I don't even know how to pronounce it. Look at that. Get a load of this. It's so my lipstick doesn't bleed into my skin. Cause you know, I don't want that to happen. I don't want it on my mustache. <laughs> if what you hear in the background is this hyena that we just recently <laughs> bought. Oh my God. So let's try it out. Wait, are you really? No. <laughs> so I'll give you guys a review on that later. I can't. But yeah, <laughs> you guys told me because my lipstick was bleeding to get transparent lip liner. So I actually listened. Ooh, ASMR. ASMR. Okay. So I am back at Walmart. Don't hate me. I'm actually here because I have to be. So the antibiotics that I'm having, like antibiotics don't know the difference between good bacteria and bad bacteria. So it's taking the good bacteria out of my stomach. So I need yogurt. I hate yogurt. I try so hard to like it, but I hate it. So I'm here to get yogurt. <laughs> oh my God. I'm really annoyed by it really honestly. But um, it's just making me so sick, the antibiotic. So if yogurt can help, then I'm gonna have to like gag it down and just like kind of deal with it. So, um, Becky really wanted tacos, so we're gonna have tacos. Um, but we're just gonna, we eat it completely different. I do hard, she does soft. She uses hamburger, I use um, ground chicken. But we're gonna have tacos tonight, which I'm pretty excited for. Homemade tacos are bomb. So here's our cart sponges, ground chicken, nasty yogurt. Um, taco seasoning. These are the shells I'm gonna use. That, cheese, Becky's meat, tomato. Um, what is that, babe? Just orange juice? It's a um, chop 50. 50% less sugar and calories, wow. Lettuce, um, so that's our car. Oh, I was like, I'm forgetting something. Um, I'm just gonna get one of these zero squeeze lemonade thingies. Um, from the looks of it, there is no aspartame, so yay to that. I actually really do like this, it's actually really good. Um, I've been drinking nothing but water, but I was craving something with like flavor, so I was like, you know what, this won't hurt me too bad. So, this is what I really want Twix or Reese's, oh my god. Uh, tried my hardest, I'm not gonna do it. So, look what Rarity did. Doesn't that look kinda out of place? She broke that. <sighs> Cats are obsessed with trees and ornaments. Ugh, and she was like batting one around earlier, but yeah, she broke the tree. So, for how much 
I spend on Torrid. They sent me a Torrid VIP like card. I'm not sure how it works. I was reading the paper about it. Something about every dollar I spend, I get a point plus a daily bonus point. And then every 250 points I have, I get like a $20 reward. So, I don't know. I also got something from Weight Watchers. I still have a Weight Watchers membership or subscription, whatever it's called. I can't cancel it because it's under like a contract type, type style. Um, I got a certain amount of months. So if I try to cancel it, I have to pay like extra. So I still have it and I log my weight on there. So, oh, I don't want to tell you guys how much I've lost, but they gave me a little thing because I think like two weeks ago, I updated my weight on there. Aww. I don't know where my other one went, but they gave me a little, um, like chain thing. Um, that's super cute. I love that. Love that. It's to go on like a chain or like, I mean, whatever. I, I'd put it on a chain. I just don't know where my other one, because they sent me another one like, long time ago like over six months i have no idea where it is so but thank you weight watchers that's super sweet all right you guys it's time to do comment of the day you filmed the most mundane but couldn't film a ufo i wasn't vlogging that day um sorry i mean i didn't even think of it i love and support you no matter what thank you so much mallory i definitely need the support I don't know why people getting so mad that you touch things in stores. Some people are just more tactile. Nothing wrong with that. I'm not going to buy something I haven't touched either. Exactly. I don't think I've <laughs> really known anyone who doesn't touch anything in stores. I'm very touchy. I'm very hands-on. And I like to feel, just subconsciously feel, and I like to hold and look at the things that I might buy. Oh my gosh, does no one else hear the heavy breathing while Amber Lynn is walking around TJ Maxx? Remind me of those KDW videos, LMAO. That wasn't me breathing hard. I just want to let you guys know. You you wouldn't have been able to hear me because <laughs> I wasn't really near the camera. I don't really know what you're hearing. It might have been Becky because literally the camera was right next to her mouth. So I think it was just normal regular breathing that you were hearing. Ha 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 ha. Doc Amberlynn, always to the rescue. In this video, I saw a doctor, so I don't know if you're referring to anything I said regarding that. Anything I said was definitely just coming from my doctor. I like doing things that scare me. Hey, how about you lose some weight then? I have lost some weight, so yay to me. Ha, oh, that's so cute and sweet. Becky coming to tell us hi and kiss her. Yeah, it was definitely unexpected because like, She's been super like shy on the vlogs lately and I understand why because people have been saying some bull crap. But yeah, I thought it was cute and sweet too. So this is the last one I'm gonna do. You cut out TJ Maxx music and then you put your cheesy on hold music. Oh my gosh, either way it's copyright music. So there's a few things I wanna say about this. Yes, I took out TJ Maxx's music. Any YouTuber would have done that. You do not wanna get copyright strikes on your channel. And I don't think the music that I choose is cheesy, but I mean, you can think what you want and have your own opinion. It is Vlogmas, so that means there will be cute Christmas music on my videos. And the songs that I use are not copyright music. They're copyright free. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.